afraid because of that. Because I found out who I was in Christ, okay? And my purpose, my identity. So, our identity is fractured because of all kinds of, you know, childhood experiences and wounds and most of it, it starts um, at home. So now we have the uh, dysfunctional family right there. A characteristic of dysfunctional family, perfectionism. It has to be a certain way. You cannot move this. You cannot change it. This is the way I want it. A parent, a mother or a father, will make sure that everyone follows their rules in a harsh way, harsh discipline. Then there is no communication, expression. You cannot say yes or no. You cannot express your opinion. Your voice is stolen from you, right? And then comparison. Oh, that's where jealousy starts between siblings. Don't ever, parents, don't ever compare your children to one another. They're all created in so unique way and beautiful. And with God-given temperament, they're, they're not the same. They should never be the same, okay? So make sure you do not compare. You just cherish them, you value them, approve them, and you love them and accept them unconditionally. Okay? And then uh, addiction in the family, control, conflict, abuse, and fear. And then the children will take, pick up a role to survive all this because they don't know how else to survive, what else to do. As a hero, clown, lost child, scapegoat. You can, as I said, I'm going to send all these notes to you. You can